Hi little skeletons, it's Disney Queen Skelly here. Welcome back to the Disney Quiz Marathon. Today's quizzes are kicking off with which Moana character are you? When you stare off into the ocean horizon, what do you think about? Myself, other islands, oink, or water? Just water. The best stories are no stories, oink, your stories, adventures. I would say adventures. What's your favorite way to travel? Boat, oink, any and all by land. It's usually by plane, but we'll go any and all. What do you do if you see someone new? Oink. Okay, I think I know who that is supposed to be. Get to know them, ignore them, tell them about yourself. I usually ignore them unless, like, I have to get to know them. What are you most thankful for? Your belongings? Oink. Your land? Your family? I'd say my family. What would you want with you if you were stranded on an island? Your family? What? Oink. A boat. I'd say a boat. When you see a pool, you oink, cannonball, run away, dive in. Cannonball. Pick one. Ah. You're Moana. You're all set to sail away. Away. You have an adventurous spirit, a clear head, and you trust your instincts. Let them guide you where you're meant to be. Sounds good to me. Let's move on to the next quiz. So this quiz is, which Disney villain quote should be your catchphrase? Pick a favorite Disney movie. Out of these, Hercules. Describe your Halloween costume style. I usually try to go creepy. Pick a costume accessory. Let's go with a magic staff. Pick a pumpkin spice flavored treat. None, please. Pick your ideal evil sidekick. Kronk, Iago, Pain, and or Panic, or Mr. Smee. Pain and Panic. Pick your favorite powerful title. King, Queen, Best Dress, master slash mistress of all evil pick a favorite disney villain so we got evil queen frollo gaston or queen of hearts gaston pick your favorite monster mummy swamp thing monster frankenstein's monster or werewolf let's go with a werewolf your catchphrase would be memo to me maim you after my meeting this quote from Hades and Hercules is both a threat to your underlings and a handy reminder of yourself use often <gasps> i love it I love it. I got Hades, a Hades quote. It's perfect. Let's move on to the next quiz. So this quiz is name the Disney Pixar film from the concept art. Okay, so that's obviously Wally. -E. That's that's Toy Story Two. That looks like nothing I've ever seen. Monsters Inc. That looks like Presto, but I don't think that's Presto. The Incredibles. No. Hang on a minute, that's a guy with a key on a bunch of reporters. No, that's not a key, what is that? That's Eve, is that Wally again? No, what, what is this? Oh, that's Up. Which movie does this concept art belong to? That looks like the good, good dinosaur? No, there's a lot of buildings. Well, shit, why am I blanking on this crapiola monsters inc okay well that doesn't even look like monsters inc that doesn't even look like a monster that oh my god are you kidding me at this point let's go finding nemo no finding dory no what the hell could this be the incredibles again if that's supposed to be the school this isn't really helping Okay, well, the only thing I can think of here is cars. That definitely looked like Monsters, Inc. Inside Out? Maybe this is a concept for Bing Bong? Oh, Lordy Lou. Mon Monsters Universe? University? Okay. That's the good dinosaur. That's Finding Nemo. These, some of those were needlessly complicated. Good guesses. It's tough when you're put on the spot. Take the quiz again to see if you can get a few more. No, thank you. I'm going to move on to the next quiz. So this quiz is, can you match the Disney movie to the runtime? Dumbo it clocks in at 64 minutes. Toy Story clocks in at 81. The Little Mermaid clocks in at, I believe, 82. Finding Nemo clocks in, I do believe, at 95. Nope. 
Mulan clocks in at 104. Peter Pan clocks in at 76. Pocahontas clocks in at 82. Cinderella clocks in at 75. Frozen clocks in at 115. Nope. The Aristocats clock in at 82. The Lion King, I'll say, clocks in at 88. Cars clocks in at 98. Nope. Emperor's New Glue, no, New Glove, New Groove, 89. Aladdin, I'll guess 76. Beauty and the Beast, 84. Tarzan, we'll say 95. Lilo and Stitch, I'm willing to go 85. Pirates of the Caribbean, 122. Up, 96. Tangled, we'll say 99. Got 10 out of 20. You are well on your way to becoming a Disney movie expert. The best course of study? Rewatch some Disney movies and try again. You never really think about the runtime all that much. You're just enjoying the movie. That's what that's what you do when you watch Disney movies. You don't think about the runtime. You think about the enjoyment of it. Let's move on to the next quiz. So this quiz is, which Disney hair statement should you try? Hopefully not Simba's mane, because I feel like I already have that right now. My favorite decade is the 2000s. If I could dye my hair any color, I would choose, I'd say like a silver, not a gray, but we'll go red because I've done that before. When I style my hair, I always straighten it, comb it, do nothing to it, curl it. I just, I brush it, that's all. My friends would describe me as bold, shy, unique, or humorous. Definitely unique. I can't style my hair without magic, a hairbrush, a comb, hairspray. Definitely a hairbrush. When I wake up in the morning, my hair is perfect everywhere in a braid and a ponytail. It is in braids. When I go to a party, my hair is usually casual. Also kind of depends on the party. Like if it's like a formal party, then yeah, I'll like straighten it, I'll curl it, I'll do something nice to it. But if it's just like a normal party, I just leave it as is usually. In my free time, I like to read, listen to music, dance, or watch TV. I don't watch TV much anymore, but I do like to read. My clothing style is, God, I could wish I could have that outfit. Classic, ele eclectic, sporty, or chic. Just classic, I guess. My main goal in life is to find adventure, success, love, or riches. Success. I should try Rapunzel's hair statement. From the length of my hair at the moment, I'm pretty sure I'll get there soon. You are classic and fun, so you need to make a hair statement that Rapunzel would be proud of. Try braids and interesting ornaments for decoration, then go out and have the best day ever with your new style. Let's move on to the next quiz. So this quiz is, can you guess the Disney character from the extreme close-up? On Des, we need a boo. That looks like a okay, okay, so we got I think that's Pascal. That's Nala. That's not Nala? Shit. That's Honey Lemon. That's Lucifer. Ooh, we got we got eyebrows here. Who have them eyebrows? Esmeralda? Nah. That's Raja. That's Jane. That's Stitch. And that is Kronk. You got 8 out of 10 correct. Impressive detective work. Spot the specifics to get a perfect score. Thank y'all so much for watching. All of these quizzes will be linked in the description box below. But other than that, I will see you tomorrow. Bye little skeletons. Stay safe. And I love you guys.